Hey, it sounds like the Secretary of State has had enough with North Korea. We will implement new country-specific sanctions aimed at North Korea's sale and procurement of arms and related materiel. As long as the North Korean leadership takes a different choice, continuing defiance, provocation, and belligerence, it will continue to suffer the consequences. It seems Hillary Clinton is sounding more in line with President Bush than President Obama. So is this a signal that Clinton is frustrated with the president's foreign policy like she was during the campaign? Joining us right now with the Fair and Balanced uh, debate, Stephen Kiernan is here. He's the author of Authentic Patriotism, Restoring America's Founding Ideals Through Progressive Action. Deneen Borelli is here, senior fellow with Project 20, uh, 21 and Fox News contributor. And Carmen Segura is here, deputy regional president of the Hispanic National Bar Association. First, Stephen. With you, do you see some you see some uh, friction there? I don't. I think you've seen consistent path, starting with uh, the North Koreans sinking that South Korean ship back in March. Right, 46 people died, and we've seen uh, continuing escalation. Uh, Secretary Clinton speaking with uh, Defense Secretary Robert Gates when she's over there. I think this is this is a kind of consistent path they've been moving on a harder line since March. That uh, you know we'll see a culmination over the military exercises off South Korea next week. But her stance seems a lot stauncher than President Obama's stance to me. What I think Hillary is doing, she's laying the groundwork for the 2012 election, and she's separating herself from the pack. I mean, if you think about it, you know, she ran with the, she lost the election, we know that, and she's moving ahead now. You look at her, her team, uh, Clinton. Obama is making, Clinton is making negative comments about Obama, Bill Clinton, and as well as James Carville complaining about the golf crisis. So you have them making comments Those as are well. the, That's the battering so, ram, and maybe Hillary Clinton's following up behind. Bill Clinton, I think, is the placeholder. Hillary's going to move in, in uh, after the midterm election, right. especially if the Democrats lose a lot of the seats. You spotting the strategy, Carmen, or no? Um, I'm, I'm split. I think it's probably Hillary, but um, for 2016, not 2012. Uh, I'm, I'm, but what you're looking at now, too, is Hillary Clinton trying to reinforce what President Bush actually laid down, where a torpedo took out a South Korean boat, and it's been months since we've had any type of concrete action, until the other day. Look, I think that what you're seeing now is a natural escalation in the process. I mean, I think it's, it's to be expected. Obama started by saying, let's start with dialogue. Hillary is her, her, his spokesperson. I think, I find it hard to believe that Hillary would go out there and take a stronger stance. But where does Obama dialogue get us with uh, North Korea and also right. with Iran? And even, mean, in and even in South Korea, they feel the same way as you, Deneen. Uh, what is this? What's new about this? How is this going to protect us? Because right. the boat was just taken out for no apparent reason. Meanwhile,